I miss Dad and his silly... <laughs> Santa Gringo accent. I heard Claire rehearse some songs. <laughs> She's got the groove. I haven't seen any actual fish in there since we got here. Sorry for getting upset, Sean. I... I just don't feel comfortable talking about all this. It's... Hey... Claire? What's on your mind, Sean? Do you know anything about... Dad's funeral? There was a service. We couldn't make it in time, but we sent flowers. I'm sorry, Sean. It's okay. I just want to make sure somebody took care of him. Hopefully, you can go visit him at some point. At some point? Yeah. What did you think of Dad? You can tell me. I won't get mad. Well, your father was... Uh, he was his own person. That's it? I mean, I know you guys didn't really get along. It's just... Esteban was very different from us. And he never took a single step to change any of that. Did you? I wish we would have. Some bridges you can't cross. I can only live with regrets now. Don't worry. You guys taking care of us is all he would have wanted. That's a very kind thing of you to say, Sean. Thank you. What's the story with your neighbor? Charles? Oh. Poor man used to be a basketball coach, but had to move out here after his wife's passing. He's got a job at the rail yard now, and, well, he's still recovering. Wow. I mean, that's sad. We tried to give him a hand, keep an eye on his drinking problem. His son Chris is a little angel, though. I think Daniel would be a good influence on him. He's got a great role model, after all. <sighs> Thanks. I'm trying my best. Well, thanks, Claire. You are very welcome. It's always a pleasure to speak with my grandsons. Such a big fireplace. And not even needed. <sighs> That's luxury. Feeling of love? Passion, princess? <laughs> Escape to pleasure? Man, does Claire read all these? Hey, I want to be in your drawing. Oh, don't draw me like this, Sean. I'm a mess. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm drawing the whole room. Good. It's so nice to see you practice. You're so passionate. Time moving. to take the pen, dude. Hope I look good. <sighs> okay. Got it. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want.
I better catch up with Steven and get those keys. <laughs> Daniel's going nuts in here. Tried one of Claire's books yesterday. It's basically a telenovela with white old women. Three years ago, but she's still with us, day after day. Isn't she in heaven? <laughs> Man, can you imagine watching a slasher out here? <laughs> Deep in the woods. Gee, no one around. I could never do that. No way. Two stairs. Whoa, look at all these decorations. That's so cool. Clean kitchen equals clean conscience. Of course I am. When do we start? I wonder where this was taken. I don't picture Claire and Steven as world travelers. Have you ever seen any actual fish in there? Never. I don't know when Daniel will be able to go back to his school. I get why they love their town so much. It's kind of cute. Daniel seems so happy to be here. Hey, what's up? Oh, so you actually showed up on time. The train is about to leave the station. I'm new to the job, but I'm ready, Chief. Now, I could be a real superhero and save the train from disaster. I remember playing this when I came here years ago. Man. Things were so different back then. This model is so amazing. Yeah, Grandpa says it took decades to build. Can you believe it? It's crazy. It's way cooler than anything I ever did in Minecraft. going to derail. Hmm. Sounds like something stuck in that tunnel. I wonder if Steven has ever seen a flying train. Ooh, there actually was something stuck in there.
man. I miss that dirty little dog. So much more than I thought I would. I don't even know how Beaver Creek looks like. We're not allowed to get out. Finally, some fresh air. Hmm. Think I need a handy assistant. Can you hand me the glue in the cupboard behind me? Sure. Hold on. Whoa! Careful. Sorry, I've, I forgot. That thing isn't too stable. Let me just... Uh, okay. Sorry. My fault. Your grandmother keeps telling me, but uh, I'm a lazy old man. Hey. Uh, can you close the door? I want to talk for a second. Oh. Uh, it's the power cable, of course. It happens all the time. So, listen, I've uh, noticed things with Daniel. You know what I'm talking about, don't you? Um, uh, not really. What things? Well, I, I'm not sure how to put it. Like, some kind of invisible force. Like the holy gift or something. Um, yeah. Daniel likes to pretend he's got superpowers, but that's it. That's it? Okay. But be careful, Sean. You know, he's still so young. Sure. And by the way, let's keep this between us. Claire has a lot of strong beliefs. She wouldn't understand. She adores Daniel, and just wants both of you to be safe and happy. What I'm trying to say is, uh, maybe you should stay here with us. I know you boys plan to run to Mexico, but... Uh... Thanks. Maybe we could, but... Why not? I know, being out here in the sticks with us old farts isn't exciting, but this is your home now. It's cool. Kind of different, but... I just don't want you to get into trouble because of us. It's dangerous to be on the road. Do you think your father would have wanted this for his kids? Of course not. But everything's different now. I know. I know. Well, just think about it. But don't torture yourself. I will. Hey, uh... Claire said you had the keys for the tool shed? Oh, uh, sure. <clears throat> Here. You guys enjoy the sun. And be careful with that shed. It's probably a mess inside. Thanks. It's good to see you in my lair. You know, you were afraid to come in here as a kid. Really? Man, who did this? Oh, it was our neighbor's son, Chris. Wow. Is that you? Oh, yeah, that was taken when I retired. The mayor came to congratulate me himself. That's awesome. Yeah, really great day. Ah, I wish you'd been here. Well, 
I'm sorry, Sean. I know you guys miss your games and your websites, but trust me, a break from all this can only do you good. You know, and it's it's safer that way. Yeah, yeah. I know. So here this will be all right. Uh, mm. Damn, this thing is ancient. Wish I could use it anyway. Stephen sure takes his hobby. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, God. you found this. I, uh, I just forgot to, uh, it's okay. It's been a while since I've seen her face. Uh, yeah. I like taking a look at it from time to time. Doesn't it hurt? Yeah, it does. But she's still my daughter, you know? I can't approve what she's done, but I, I, uh, I think I understand. Good. I don't. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, Jean. Please don't... Uh, uh, please don't say anything to Claire about this, okay? Don't worry. I won't. <laughs> How come you have a disco ball? Are you like... Throwing parties no. and stuff? <laughs> no, this is a, a souvenir, you know? I actually met your grandma during a disco night, believe it or not. For real? <laughs> That's so cool. She was such a good dancer. Mm. We danced the hustle, <laughs> and I, I knew I was going to marry that woman. Aww. <laughs> By the way, I have no idea what you're talking about, but it sounds so very cute. <laughs> well, I'd show what it is if only these hips allowed me to. Oh, there you are, Sean. Got the key? Hey, I have to go out and run some errands. Can you do me a big favor? Do you know how to work a washing machine? Since I was about eight. Of course. Can you throw in yours and your brother's clothes after the next load? They're in the bathroom basket. Totally, yeah. Um, no problem. Thanks so much. Feel free to keep on tidying your stuff, too. It's good for the health to keep the house clean. Definitely. Daniel can help. Ah, and remember, for your own safety, no phone and no internet. I know, I know, boring rules. Don't worry, Claire. Hey, Daniel, there's work for you. Uh, no, I'm busy. D busy my ass. Come over here. <laughs> you gotta find me first. <sighs> gotta do the laundry first. <sighs> Jeez. I hope we won't get Claire and Steven into trouble. Oh. I get that he's sick of all this shit, but why are we playing this game? As always with Claire, I can't really tell if this is cute or bossy.
gotcha. Hmm. <sighs> yeah. Pretty different from the one we had back at home. <sighs> yeah. Pretty different from the one we had back at home. Oh, this looks cool. Too bad it's broken. Hey, um, have you seen Daniel? He's hiding somewhere. <laughs> Running away from chores. I can relate. Sorry, Sean. He's, he's not in here. I swear. <sighs> yeah. Well, <laughs> thanks. Don't know why crooked frames stress me out like this. This used to be Karen's room. This used to be Karen's room. Wonder what they've done with it. I know you're in there. Gotcha! What the? Behind you! Yeah, very funny. No more hiding. Seriously. Okay, okay. What do I have to do? You tidy the mess in our room, and I take care of the laundry. Cool? Yeah, sure. It's hot. I know. Thanks. Yeah, let me just throw our clothes in the machine and we're good. It's cool that Claire does her little paintings. Better be careful with it. Looks expensive. How many programs does this thing have? Okay. It will do. Boring laundry? Done. Time for fresh air. Daniel, you ready? <laughs> we can go out now. Yes, wait for me. Oh, man, finally. It feels so good to be outside. It reminds me of the cabin. <laughs> oh! 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 Watch out for the pack. <laughs> so.
So that's the treehouse Stephen helped out with. Pretty awesome. Can't believe it's already been a week since we got here. Get ready for storage wars. What's wrong? <sighs> Frozen shut. Of course. Sean, look! Um, see what? We just got here. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. Uh, I didn't see anything either. Oh, uh, oh, oh. Okay, I just fell down into the snow. Dad says I'm kind of clumsy. That t-shirt is wicked. Who's your favorite superhero? I love Power, Power Bear. Bear. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! I have the Mega Power Bear! You should check it out! Dude! That's so cool! Chris, oh god. Look, I, I am so sorry. Are you okay? Uh, Dad, I'm fine. I promise. Uh, are you sure? Listen, I shouldn't... Do you know them? It it's okay, Dad. They're cool. He loves superheroes. Even Power Bear. Ah, gotcha. Hey there. Are you staying with the Reynolds? Oh, uh, yeah. They're our grandparents. Uh, I see. Oh, geez, Chris. You don't have any damn shoes on. I'm sorry, buddy. Let's get you inside. I, uh, yeah. Okay, Dad. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Oh, and, uh, if Claire asks, tell her everything is fine. Sure. Uh, no problem. Cool. See you around, then. Thanks, guys. See you later? Yes, we will. <sighs> Daniel, did you forget everything about the rules already? Sorry, Sean. Did you want me to let him fall? Really? No, you... You did the right thing. But listen, we can't let anybody know. We have to keep a low profile out here. He's like my age. I bet you would have done the same exact thing. Don't be mad. I'm not mad, dude. It's... It's over. Daniel... Remember that we're hiding out, so no training and no showing off your power. From now on, you stick with me all the time, okay? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
fuck. That kitten never listens. Okay. Time to get Daniel at the Ericsons. Daniel didn't give a shit about what I told him yesterday. Claire? Steven? Anybody home? Well, looks like I'm home alone. Oh, right. Jeez. Steven went search crazy on us. Look at this. These articles are almost a month old. Maybe they stopped looking for us? What the hell is this? I had no idea Steven could fall for this bullshit conspiracy theories. Well, maybe I could use the phone while they're away. We had a good time decorating the tree together last night. Daniel loved it. Steven and Claire are gonna freak if they realize he went to the Ericsons. Well, I guess they won't be back for at least two hours. Okay, let's get this brack back home now. <sighs> Why does Daniel never listen? Maybe I'm doing it wrong. <sighs> and I thought Daniel was the crafty one. What the fuck? 
I'm gonna kill him. Daniel, what's going on here? Sean, wait, don't freak out. I can't explain. Let me tell him. Sean, I know it sounds crazy, but I have a superpower. You saw me yesterday. I know you did. I was flying. I can move things, objects, with my mind. Oh, superpower, really? Yes. Great. And you don't realize what that implies? Everyone can see you from the outside. You could get in real trouble. This is dangerous. Do you understand? Yes. We hear you. We promise to be careful. This is just our secret, okay? Nobody can find out I'm the real Captain Spirit. And nobody will. Ever. Now you're an official member of the Spirit Squad. If you betray us, I'll disintegrate you. <laughs> nah, just kidding. Oh yeah, we need a... Team Signal. Totally! I'm gonna be... Super Wolf. What's your super name, Sean? How about the Silver Runner? Cool? Cool, right? Hmm, not bad. That's true, you're a great runner. Okay, guys, I think we're ready to roll. Uh, excuse me, who are you? I'm Sean. Uh, oh yeah, uh, sorry man, you're here for Daniel. Hey, let's make it official. I'm Charles Erickson. Nice to meet you. Hope you know that Daniel and Chris are a dangerous team. We better watch out, or they're gonna take over the world. Yeah, they share a lot of things, as thick as thieves. Can we go get the Christmas tree now? We're both ready to fly. Yes, yes, yes. The, the team has been waiting too long. Hey, you should come along too. There's nothing going on over here. Yes! Can't wait to see all the decorations. And Sean, we could buy Christmas presents for Grandma and Grandpa. Well, they'll worry if we leave the house. And remember, you still have to get better, Daniel. Sean, come on. Why do you always have to be a party pooper? It's the first time I've been out for days. We won't be gone for long. The market's only a few miles away. Anyway, they'll be at the service for at least another hour. Yeah, Sean, I can show Daniel around. You can come with us. Please say yes. Please, please. Please? <sighs> okay, you win. Not a fair fight. So let's go. <laughs> yes! Yeah! See? Dangerous. Okay, team, uh, give me a time out to clean up the back seat. I'll honk when I'm done. Ooh, uh, can I use the bathroom? Of course. Oh, you'll see my comic books. I'm glad you're coming, too. Hey, you want to see my toys? Oh, score! The new hot dog man? Since you're a new member of the team, you have to know everybody. These are Captain Spirit's friends and his enemies. Dude, that's pretty cool. Can you guess who are the good guys and the villains? Let's see. Hmm, okay. The bad guys, the good guys. Not that easy, right? Interesting.
Okay. How did I do? You're not a very good observer. Okay, let me introduce them to you. This is Team Spirit, the good guys. There's the Forest Warrior, Power Bear, Marty Rex, and Sky Pirate. So, who are the bad guys? That's Noctarius and the Shark Stinger. There's also Snowmancer, but he's out in the garden. But they're all working for Mantroid, who's the real supervillain. So, where is he? Hiding out on his evil planet, waiting for me. But Captain Spirit and Super Wolf will make sure he doesn't hurt anyone. <laughs> yeah, strength in numbers. Sounds like Mantroid is in trouble. Just wait until he sees what Captain Spirit can do now. <sighs> yeah, about that. Um, does your dad know about any of this? Did he see something? Yesterday? No, he didn't see anything, and the power didn't work yesterday. After I fell. I uh, must have been too tired. Okay, good. Um, I mean, he could be pretty disturbed if he knew. I'm definitely not telling Dad. I don't want to freak him out. He's worried about other stuff anyway. Chris, it's none of my business, but are you and your dad okay? Uh, what do you mean? I don't know, um, Claire seems to be worried about you guys. Claire's always worried. We're cool. Totally. He's just, he has a hard time being on his own. That's all. Well, I can understand that. But I hope you know you're not alone. Thanks, Sean. But I don't feel scared anymore. I have the power, and I have Daniel. Ah, cool. Sorry, the water eater is still broken. There's the signal. Come on, Daniel. Hey! Pro tip, don't go in there. Yeah. <laughs> okay, squad, let's roll. You need my jacket? I, I don't want you catching another cold. No, I'm good, thanks. And don't be waving your arms around when I'm driving, okay? <laughs> yeah. Um. Remember, Daniel, don't mess around. All right. Jeez. Okay, buddy, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Hey! You guys go ahead and we'll come back to meet you, okay? Brothers meeting. Sure. But... Don't get lost. Dude, what the fuck are you doing? I can't believe it. 
How many times do we have to keep going over the rules? Don't show the power. I know. But Tris thinks he can do all this cool stuff. I wish he could. He reminds me of Noah. I just miss having friends, Sean.